Hello, respect and welcome to Cooking with Students. I'm Levi Roots, the Dragon Slayer, and today I'll be cooking my fabulous Rasta Pasta. Lord of mercy. Somebody put some music in the food for me. Give me some. Reggae, reggae songs. Reggae, reggae songs. It's so nice I have been in it twice when we call it. Reggae, Rasta reggae Pasta, songs. my easiest dish ever. It's so easy that you can do it before I finish one song. But before we do that, let's de bling shall we? Next we gotta wash our hands, don't forget that. So come on, let's do that. I'm gonna be using some spaghetti, obviously. Um, I've got some spaghetti on actually, so come on, let's have a look, just to let you know what's happening. There you go, this is just a pack of ordinary spaghetti, just bung it in there, a little bit of salt, maybe a little bit of oil if you want, just to keep them separated. Lid on, eight minutes or so, and it's done. Now, let's do the most important part, which is making the sauce, and I'm the sauce man. So who's better to make this sauce for you? Lord of mercy. Let's get the pan on. Okay, we've got a nice pan here. First thing we're gonna add in our rasta pasta is our tomatoes. So let's bring, I've got about a tin of chopped tomatoes. So we've got the tomatoes, give it a shake and you give it your Levi root styley. Next we've got some roasted peppers looking all lovely here, look at that, a roasted capsicum. It's got red and yellow in there. So we, we get that in. Trading, no messing about. Lovely garlic. I've chopped about a clove of, of garlic here that's going to create some really nice flavors into it. So you get that in, get it all in. Next, I'm going to add a little bit of dried herbs in just to create some more flavors in there. I'm going to bung a little bit of sugar in there just to create a little bit of sweetness in there. Give it that little bit of Levi Root style. You know what I'm saying? Nah. Okay, boom. Well, there we have it now. That's really easy, like I said, you know, simple stuff in there. About four things, not a lot, but we've yet to had the bad boy in there. Which here we have it. Oh my God. Oh God, let's have a look at this. What's this hasten to had? Yes. Let's put a little bit of this in there, shall we? Yeah, come on. I'm going to put about three or so. If I can get out. Um, that's a large spoonful, but you never mind with that. Because there ain't no harm to put too much of this baby in there. And this is my reggae reggae tomato ketchup. Okay, that's a lovely rustic sauce there. It's got everything in there. Have a look at that. That looks really awesome and delicious. And as I said, ain't no thing difficult in there to pick up. You can get everything here in your local supermarkets and real cheap. So let's get it on the fire. How long does it take to cook the sauce? Um, the sauce is about 10 minutes, really, because everything is just really in there. It's just really just to, as I said, before I can sing one song, it should be ready. It's like, tick goes the tack, Rolex my watch, Savro suits and diamonds in my locks. I'm taller than Shaq, I'm madder than Max. I'm so swaggerific with style and panache. I've got these eight bars a track before I relax. And I'm rolling with Rihanna and the dude Jamie Fox. I'm like, cocky the cat, I'm like, roll on the rat. I can be your put the tat, your suffering suck attach. Okay, now it's nice and boiling, you can see. So I can add my olives now, and then it goes. So really it's just the flavors of the merge, you know, the tomatoes and the capsicum together and your herbs and spices and stuff and then it's boom, boom. So I think the spaghetti is kind of ready. So what we have to do now is drain off this liquid and return to the pan. So let's do that. Look at that, just give it a shake just to get rid of here water. Now what we're going to do now is just add the sauce to our pasta and that's rasta pasta for you. So there you go, lovely. So put the spaghetti on that fire and we add the sauce, lovely. I'm loving this. And then to merge it together and it's ready to go. The Rasta Pasta is one of my easiest dishes ever but it's not the most original name, it's not the most difficult name either. Rasta Pasta, come on. Years ago when I first said a reggae reggae sauce a lot of people said Levi, no. <laughs> Rasta Pasta, yes. This is so awesome, look at that. And we've made it ourselves. Let's plate it up now, shall we? Come on, baby. Hey. Mm. 
So let's taste my Andy Rock. Oh, come on, my root. Ah. Mm. The sauce has come racing through a bit like Usain Bolt. Like bolting through the flavors and it's hit you in the palate. And the spaghetti, because you've done it to the, the specification and it's like really come out nice, it just merges with it nicely, it melts in the mouth. The tomatoes are really there, you can actually taste it. It's really live, as I say, so it's a fantastic. Now, friends, would you like to taste some? Yes. Well, come on in. Well, let's do this. Let's do this. Special dish on your cheeks. 